Hey friends, hey, I'm Janelle J, the owner and principal interior designer for Ivy Leaf Interior Decor. And today I wanted to bring you guys along on this master closet transformation that I did for me and my husband. Yay! <laughs> As an interior designer, sometimes my home will fall by the wayside because I'm just working on so many different projects and I don't really get a chance to really dedicate the time, the energy, and even the funds to recreate some of the looks that I do in my client's home in my own home. Um, and so we were coming up on our third year anniversary and I was like, look, we can't travel. It's COVID. I'm expecting <laughs> baby girl number three. Our daughters are still pretty young to go anywhere where we would feel safe enough. So we said, you know what? Why don't we tackle some of these home projects that we have lingering? And one of those things that we wanted to do when we bought this house was the master closet. My husband and I, we are... We love clothes and we love shoes and we love fashion and we love just kind of, we just feel like it's a representation of our personality. And so for us, our closet was very important to tackle. So of course, the moment you say closet or closet makeover, all of these ads start popping up on your social media. Um, and so we looked at Ikea. Um, with Ikea, it's a lot more manual. You have to take all of your measurements and you know you kind of have to just know exactly what you're doing and because i do this work all day long i was like look i just want to hand this project over to someone and let them figure it out let me just give it to the professionals even though i know what i want to see i would rather someone else come in do all the measurements that i normally would do for a client and i just wanted to sit back and be a client so we were like ikea x that out even though they are pretty affordable I just didn't want to do the work, especially being expecting pregnant. So I was like, no, we're not doing that. Um, so then the second option was closets by design, which they have some really, really cool designs that they've done. And I was like, okay, they're a contender. And then I looked into California closets. Of course, if you know the name California closets, you know, they're pr a pretty reputable brand, a really pretty reputable company. So in my mind, I'm like, this is, California Closet is going to have a big ticket price. Like, they're going to have a big number. Closets by Design, however, will have not that big of a number. However, I'll still get the look and feel that I want, right? So, we decided to set up a consultation. When we set up the consultation, we set up the consultation with both California Closets and Closets by Design within the same week. It was at the end of August. Um, and... California Closets came first. So they came first and just on the presentation alone, California Closets win. Like they were just on it. My designer, um, she was just so patient. She was so kind. Um, she had all of my questions considered. Um, she went into my closet, took all of the measurements. I told her what I wanted to see. I told her what we had envisioned. Um, and she was like, okay. And she literally rendered everything in my home. She was able to pull out her iPad, put all the measurements into her closet sketch design tool. I think it's called CAD or something. And she put it all together within the confined, like my, within my eyes, which I was really like, whoa, like you just did all of this right here, right now. So she was able, by the time she left the consultation to sh present with me a PDF. She gave me a PDF that showed me what my closet would look like. And every time I was like, you know what? I want to give my husband another extra shoe rack, or I want to do another high low, or, you know, he has this, this piece of artwork that he wants to kind of put on display. Um, and what about jewelry? What about, you know, the drawers so that we can not have to come out to our master bedroom to kind of put on our undergarments, but we could keep everything. Like she would adjust the renderings each and every time. So she was just truly, truly phenomenal. And I think just her customer service alone sold me on California closets. So closets by design came a few days later. And when they came, she was also 
an awesome, awesome designer. However, they did a lot of things manually. Like she did the sketching manually on a sketch pad and she had all of her measurements on there. So I wasn't a big fan of that because I couldn't really see what the closet would look like. Also, um, closets by design, while they were very much so affordable and probably about, I would say about 40% less than California closets, I feel like the finishing and like the details of what they will give you doesn't truly match the aesthetics that I'm going for. Now, if you don't care about handles, if you don't care about simple things like belt holders or a valet bar or just the finishing touches on your bar when you're hanging up your clothes, then closets by design will be your perfect match. However, me as a designer, I'm really into details and California Closets delivers on detail. So if you're considering between Closets by Design or California Closets, I would say look at your budget and see what you're willing to spend. Do you want to get what you want and it look aesthetically beautiful um, at an affordable price? Then it would be Closets by Design. However, do you mind spending a little bit more to just get that kind of number one top priority detail oriented type of product then i would go california closets so california closets um one they were obviously more expensive than closets by design however they were just the most put together in my opinion of what i wanted to see additionally um the only only um flaw or just issue was that their scheduling is off the charts. So we had the consultation in early September, late August, early September. They weren't able to come and install until November 10th. So we had about two months of um, just kind of waiting. And so in those two months, I'll show you guys how we prepared to get the closet just kind of up and ready to go so that when the guys arrived, um, in November, it was ready to go. So one of the things we wanted to do was um, obviously remove all of the clothes from the closet. And of course, you know, we have a lot of things and a lot of things that a lot of items that we've accumulated over the years. So I had to enlist some help. <laughs> I enlisted my toddler, Ivory. She was helping me move all of my shoes because mommy can't bend over. Um, and so she was very, very helpful in getting a lot of the stuff out of the closet. But of course, we had to do a lot of muscle in pulling out all of the clothes out. And so once we did that, I had the grand idea of doing wallpaper. I mean, if we're going to get custom closets, why not go big? So I decided to get wallpaper. The wallpaper was ordered actually off Home Depot's website. You'd be surprised of how amazing, good quality wallpaper they have. Um, and I have some wallpaper installers that I use just with my everyday projects that um, were available to come a week before California Closets came to design. So some of the things that we had to do was take down those wire hangers, um, you know, those just mesh wire hangers that you get at Home Depot that you normally get in your closets. We had to take all of those down, pull all of the nails off the wall, and then we had to putty all of the holes so that when the wallpaper people came, all they had to do was sand it down and then start laying the wallpaper up. Um, and so the finished product was just absolutely amazing. Couldn't have chosen a better wallpaper. Honestly, I chose that wallpaper on a whim. At the same time, it was one of those things where I was just like, I think this will look good, but I don't know because I was the the brass and the and the handles with the California Closets design, I thought were gonna be more shimmery and gold, but it turns out it was the perfect wallpaper for the entire design. Um, so once we put up the wallpaper, I wanted to kind of just take a step back and just take it all in. And then a week later, California Closets arrived and they knocked it out between 10 a.m. and 1 p.m. I mean, these guys were in here working. It was only two guys, but they were, phenomenal. They were amazing. They got in here, got everything unloaded, put everything up. I just heard them drilling and, and sawing and doing things. And it's just custom to a T. They even noticed that um, my floors in the master closet, the carpet was a little unbalanced and they added trim around one of the 
um, panels so that way it doesn't look like it's lifting off the floor. So they really just take their time in ensuring that the work is truly done. And I cannot be more excited to show you guys this process.